Oh, man, I need to start going to the gym or something. Jeez. Hello, guys, and welcome back to another CAFCast Applies to the Yogscast. Today, we are carrying on with our series as per usual, but first, I just want to take a few minutes to talk to you guys about what we're doing here and why we're doing it. The series so far has been really successful, so thank you to everybody so far for watching and sharing the videos. It's been really good to see it being shared on Facebook and Twitter, uh, and with all your friends as well. I've had some really great feedback, so thank you very much. Uh, it's always nice to see people getting on board with people who are relatively new to uh, to YouTube, so it's um, it's it's a lot of fun, and I'm, I'm having a lot of fun doing it, so uh, we're going to carry on, which is a lot of fun. But don't forget why we're doing this. This is a CAFCast applies to the Yogscast series where effectively I'm trying to use this series to show the Yogscast what I can do and also to hopefully gain a bit of support from other people uh, to join the, uh, the channel, to subscribe and to like my videos so that I get noticed basically. Because it's not easy when you uh, when you first start out on YouTube but things have been going very, very well thanks to you guys so a huge thank you. Don't forget, as normal, you can like the video and share the video on your various social platforms uh, and just physically tell a friend about it always really helps. Uh, the two places that you can go to externally apart from social media is to the subreddit. Uh, there's a post that you can click on in the description uh, to be able to click there and to just leave a comment or something. Um, but the one thing that you can do externally that does really help as well is head over here to the Yogscast forums. I've got a, a thread there that I update once a week with new videos that I've been releasing uh, and it would be really helpful if you guys wanted to pop over there and leave a post about how much you're enjoying the series or just something you'd like about the CAFCast would be, would be very helpful. Uh, but anyway, without further ado, let's get stuck in. Uh, because, oh my god, he's got a Vlotraptor on his head. Or a T-Rex. T-Rex head! Yeah, sorry, sorry Cal. You're mine. You're mine. You're mine. I'll see you later. Need, need that. Oh god! Let's get him. Let's get him. Let's get him. Let's get him. Oh god, this is not good. We're gonna die again. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh. Actually, actually, it doesn't matter if we do die because we. Yeah, that's fine. We can just respawn and we're like already here immediately. Um. But it would be good if it was daytime. So how long have we got to wait until it's day? Hmm. Oh, they're fighting one another. Oh, perfect. Okay. Let's go around the long way. Let them fight. Let them fight. Hopefully there's one left and he's on a very low health. Or they both died. This one. Okay, I'm just going to have to have a punching, punching match with the skeleton. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Oh, okay. Right, that worked. So now he's dead. I can take up my chest. Or my grave, I guess. And take all my stuff back. Good. Okay, uh, a sheep, a sheep, a sheep. Well, I think I see one just in the in the here. Did I? Or, or was I just seeing things? I might have just been seeing what I wanted to see, guys. <laughs> oh no! This is like a cruel twist of fate, not being able to find one more sheep. Um, might be another one up here somewhere. I, hear, I just hear cows at the moment. Do not hear any sheep of any kind. So we may have to just sort of head back to our corpse I guess uh, which is not good not good in the slightest because it means that we are yeah there's nothing here okay okay let's not panic oh okay let's panic um that was our lot okay we can retrace our steps we can retrace our steps because I remember how to get back home kind of and it's also that the, the day is about to break morning has broken oh god did we piss off an enderman I think we might have pissed off an enderman guys ah, yeah, ah, ooh, ah okay Okay, okay, right. Heading back. Not to not to this <laughs> point, that's not not the one that we wanted. Uh, we'll have to sort of like retrace our steps, so it's like a invisible oh, he's gone. Skeleton, just like randomly despawned. Okay, so this is the village. So if I head out this way, uh, whilst eating all these carrots, because my health is like on like no hearts, which is not not the best way to live. There we go. And uh, we'll start running again. Oh, oh my god. Let's, let's just try and get out of here without getting hurt because it just uses up so much health. What we should be able to find over here somewhere is that temple that we found the quarry at. And then once we are there, we can go and find the well. And then it's sort of... Oh, there's, okay. So there's the, there's the temple. And then we need to go and find the, the desert well. 
And then once we found the desert well, we'll have the opportunity to go a little bit further, hopefully, and uh, and find our way back. Because I know it was kind of like a straight shot from from there because we found the well and then we saw... Okay, so that's the way that the well is. And then here's the temple. So we literally just went straight up. Straight, if we go straight over it and go straight through there, it should just be straight this way, uh, which will be hopefully getting us back to the house and then from the house it's like immediately there but the only the only th problem is i don't know whether or not two graves will stay i really hope they do because otherwise we'll lost all that steel uh, steel armor that we found or well, the the steel block that we found and managed to make the armor out of so that would be that would be a bit disappointing but let's not let's not worry about that until we actually get there and find out there's some really nice trees around here. I think this is actually like the tainted area, but it looks nice. I tell you, it, it kind of looks like, yeah, that's definitely growing. That's not good. Um, <laughs> well, I think we're actually quite close to that. So that could be that could be a problem. Um, but we're okay, we're okay, we're okay. It, it kind of looks like the Mystic Grove down uh, down by the zoo cast. Unfortunately, on the zoo cast, we haven't actually found any taint yet. That's the, uh, the other series, the daily series that I run on my channel every day at 6 a.m. UK time. Very early, very early. But it's there for the morning for you guys. Right, okay. Look, we've we've managed to get back here. We've succeeded. I'm holding an arrow um, as if it was some kind of thing that is more powerful than what else we're using, but it's not. We should probably just quickly head back to the quarry and take any cobblestone that's in there out because the last thing we want to do is run out of space in that chest. And it's going to happen very quickly, I reckon. That's actually already quite far down, which is pretty awesome. Um, let's have a look. Okay, so it's only actually got two stacks of cobblestones. That's that's not too bad. Okay, we're heading out. We've definitely got enough wool, is the, is the good news, if we can get back to our grave. The bad news is, I don't know whether or not graves are like permanent things or whether or not you lose your graves um, procedurally and could only have one. We died around um, some cactuses. I think it's over there. I think. I think that's where we went. Hmm. So I guess go have a look. I might be wrong. Oh no, it looks like there's a yeah, it looks like there's a grave on top of the Oh okay, yeah there is a grave here. And a beehive, yeah, and my little experience balls. <laughs> Oh, there's some extra loot. Okay, I'll take these heads. Take that. Okay. Thank God for that. <laughs> I was really worried that we weren't actually going to get this stuff back. So, thank God for that. All this stuff. Uh, right, okay. So, we can throw away a few things. We can throw away these two stacks. We can throw this single apple, this crafting bench. Uh, these pork chops can be combined with those. No, oh, it's beef and pork. Uh, it's probably worth actually trying to keep those and go throwing out other stuff instead. Uh, the light grey wool we can get rid of because we have enough of those in there. And that's it. There we go. We've got everything. Oh, perfect. Okay. So we're going to head back. We're going to go into that little hole. We're going to make a bed and we're going to put it there. Uh, and then we will just sort of like have to take that bed with us um, and go back and forth with it, I guess. Because that seems to be the only way to keep things from you know being really horrible and wet. Because um, that is... That is pretty disappointing. The last thing you guys want to do is watch me run around like a madman for 10 minutes and, and die and, uh, <coughs> and hinder our progress, um, which is not... Let's have a look at how far this down now. Oh, God, yeah. That's going well. That's going really well. I can't really see that well. It's very dark. Um, it looks like we might actually have hit a cave. Let's have a look in here. Oh, yes, we did. Oh, we, oh okay, zombie dungeon. Zombie dungeon. Zombie dungeon. Oh. Well, I mean, honestly, I, I, everyone's just is gonna say you, you, you've scripted this, calf. This is not. You, there's no way. But honestly, like, I did not set that up at all. That is just like, wow. Okay, well, we'll have to see what loots, what epic loots are in there with the Zed. Uh, we'll put this armor on. Uh, we've still got the steel chest plate and the iron leggings. We seem to have lost some of the armor, which I guess maybe the durability was really small, perhaps? I'm not sure. Uh, we've still got three pieces of iron, which means we can make an iron sword, which we will do once we've made this damn bed. <laughs> okay, bed is made. 
Uh, have we got an iron pick on us? No, we've just got a stone pick. So we did. Oh no, it is. It is there. We have an iron pick there. We will just for this though. We'll just use the stone pick. Um, we'll just put the bed kind of down here next to this chest, and then it's all kind of like along in a row, isn't it? So we've got sort of plenty of things. But I might just take out these two bits here in case I can't sleep properly in there because I, I can't sleep currently because it's daytime. But anyway, that's fine. Okay. So we're going to make an iron sword because apparently we don't have the balls or the power or anything to uh, to actually take any take people out, which is not good. So we just need to put those in there, with that like that. Okay, we've got a sword. We've got a sword now, an iron sword. We need to find more sort of steel and other decent sort of pieces. Um, can we make anything with that thormium? Let's have a look. Thor, oh, thormium. We can make nothing. Oh, no, we can make thorium broadswords and stuff, but that's all Tinker's constructs. So we need to make a smeltery for that, which we may do at some point. It's up to you guys, really. Um, uh, let me know in the comments whether or not you feel like you want to see something along the lines of uh, going down that route, mate, doing Tinker's, doing a full proper series, or if you just want to see me find some diamonds, uh, put some diamonds on, and go and take out that tower first. Um, let me know in the comments, because uh, it, it's, it is a series, basically, for you guys. So whatever you say goes, and I'm more than happy. We're actually doing quite well here. Let's put down some of these ores again, because obviously that's stuff that will stack up over time. But I think there might be, like, more than 60, more, or well, however many like blocks this is, worth of different things that you can get. Certs ore. That's fine. Oh, that's there as well. Okay, that's good. So I think that's probably going to be okay. Uh, I'll take these pieces of dirt and we'll just stop throwing things away again. Get out of here. Dirt. Cobblestone. Don't need you. See you later, cobblestone. Other piece of dirt. See you later. Okay, that's good. And take this one as well. And then we'll just kind of go from there. Maybe more cobblestone here and here. And we'll just take that from there. That's fine. Okay. Awesome. Well, I think that's gone really well, actually, <laughs> even though we died and had to come back again and all that kind of stuff. Um, I think we'll, we'll, we'll end it here. And hopefully by the time we get back, this will be full of like bountiful goods and, and lovely things. So, oh, actually, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. I know you guys are probably like screaming at me, Calf, go and take out this damn dungeon. Well, have we got torches? Yes, we have. Go and light up this damn dungeon and take out the zombies and see what's in that chest. And I say to you, okay, we'll do that before we before we go, um, because it's clearly something that's very dear to your heart. Oh my god, there's, they're everywhere. But they also can't get to me, which is good. Ha-ha! <laughs> hey, zombies. How, how's how's life? Are you, are you, are you struggling with the, the flow of the water? Are you having a bad, having a bad day? Oh, I could probably, should probably eat something before. I'm just going to eat here. I hope you guys are okay. I'm just going to have a nice little bit of food. Mmm. Oh, so tasty. I'm sure you guys would like to eat my flesh, but uh, sorry, not today. <laughs> I probably shouldn't tease them because I'll, I'll end up just getting ruined. Okay, here we go. This is working good. Yeah, take you out, take you out. Oh, yeah. That's good. Right. Uh, oh, it's a heart there as well. Whoop. I love that sound. And the boop. Okay, so if we just quickly cordon this off a little bit, um, I guess it'll have to be with this wood. Uh, let's see if we can do this without it ruining it completely. There we go. Now that is like just sort of specifically this area has been like cordoned off. Let's put torches down sort of like this. We'll break that one as well. Um, it needs to be of a, like a certain sort of size um, of darkened blocks. I don't know. I, I kind of understand how this works. Um, we'll just sort of like put one here and then put one. Or is that okay? No, that's a bit dark in there as well. Put one there. Uh, and then one just like over here in the corner. So then it's all nice and bright and stuff. We can have a little peek at what the quarry is doing as well, can't we? Look. Oh, it's quite dark. But he's uh, he's doing well. He's, he's still going down there. There's a squid in there. Having a good time. I think I've put this off <laughs> for long enough, haven't I? Should we see what's in our chests? Here we go. And. Ba -dow. Okay, we've got some nether warts, which is good. Name tag, so we can name a horse or something. A staff of traveling, which is pretty cool. Uh, I think that's a, like a blinky teleporty kind of thing. Ender lily seeds, some nether quartz, some more rusty nails, which is always good. And enough uh, of this fantastic string to make a bow. We'll get rid of these saplings and the zombie brains. We don't need those. 
Uh, okay, cool. Chest number one, a success. In fact, I'm going to take it up because we could probably do with the chests as well anyway. Uh, so, oh no, actually they're rubber factory saplings. We, we do need those. Uh, we'll get rid of the wool as well instead. There we go. And in here we have a portal spawner. Close without redstone, no. Type default portal gun. What? If anybody knows what that is, let me know. Uh, I've got a logic matrix programmer from factorization, which is interesting. We'll get rid of this uh, stone axe. Blue stone, random things. Uh, good, good, good. Uh, red heart, part of the heart canisters can be eaten to restore 10 hearts, uh, which is good. Again, that's going to be very useful. Get rid of the egg. Gunpowder, a mundane power catalyst. Oh my god. Honestly, this is crazy. Um, we'll, we'll use that. Uh, we'll just get rid of this one. The single solitary piece of iron. That's not really the string. Um, Gunpowder, we don't need to worry about that. In fact, I probably would have preferred to have the iron than the piece of leather. Uh, and then the arrows, uh, the gunpowder instead of the arrows again, because then, I mean, to be honest with you, we can always come back and get this more of this stuff later. But I definitely want to pick up this chest again. There we go. And uh, this has all been lit up now. So, <laughs> there we go. Fantastic. Well, the quarry is going to carry on doing its thing. I think it's night time, so it has actually stopped. But this is a good chance for us to use our new bed. And not only that, but actually uh, put down some doors on our little sort of like cave hole thing. I've got some weird circles around me. I've got some weird... Okay, they're gone now. Um, there must be something to do with the... I don't know. Honestly, don't know. <laughs> that's a little bit scary. If anybody knows what that's about, let me know. <laughs> oh my god, okay. We don't actually have enough wood, so... Uh, no, I think... Okay, we'll, we'll just quickly do this. Do I have a force mitt still? I'll tell you what, I do have I do have some sticks, and I have my force mitt there, so we've got enough room for the wood. Boop, 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 Done. Okay, and we'll get rid of this dirt instead, and get rid of these. Uh, there's and there. Fantastic. Okay, that's good. So we've now got some wood. We're going to use it to make a load of planks. We're going to make two doors, and I'm just going to drop this in here, and maybe drop the heads in here, and the chests in here, and just kind of that. I guess. I don't know. We just need some space. <laughs> we just need some space. I might actually make a backpack at some point. That might make a bit more sense. Well, there we go, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode today. Don't forget, this series is all about sharing the Kafka. So make sure, if you enjoy the episodes, to let your friends know via social media and, more importantly, let everybody know in real life. Just just say hello and, and, and let them know. And always, uh, as per usual, you have the Reddit... Uh, uh, Yogscast forums and you also have the uh, let me think the Yogscast forums themselves the official Yogscast forums where I do have a thread there is loads of information in the description so if you want to help out if you feel like you want to be that guy and, and, and help me out uh, it will be greatly appreciated and uh, and there's there's uh, plenty of information about how to do that in the uh, in the description but for now I've been Cathcast Thank you very much for watching, guys, and don't forget to let me know what you want me to do next in the comments. Do you want to take out the big tower? Do you want to go caving? Do you want to go explore some more of the area? Let me know, and I'll see you all next time. Take care, guys. You've been watching the Gaffcast. We hope you have enjoyed the show. Don't forget to check out all of our other videos. Oh, and be sure to subscribe to us if you like what you see. That way I'll know to make more and that you really like me. So, you've been watching the Gaffcast. We hope you have enjoyed the show. Don't forget to check out all of our other videos.